Welcome back to my channel. If you are new here, hello, my name is Katie. I live in Orlando and I do all shop with me videos, Target, home goods, grocery shopping, sometimes I do cleaning motivation, all sorts of hauls of all of my favorite things that I buy. I just love sharing it with you guys. So if you love videos like that, definitely make sure you give this video a big thumbs up and make sure you hit the subscribe button down below. Today's video is a home goods shop with me. Honestly, if I'm being really honest, I hope that I don't find anything I wanna buy today. I have spent so much money this last week um, just on like birthday presents and family in town and that sort of thing. So not finding anything I wanna buy would be great, which means of course we're probably gonna come across some amazing stuff that I definitely wanna buy or I've been looking for because that's just how life works, you know what I mean? We're still looking for a lot of like outdoor furniture and just some like little like decorative wall art. I'm looking for a few more hanging baskets. I know I'm gonna need a, actually a bunch more for my hanging basket wall that I wanna do. I only have a couple and you need a bunch in like varying sizes so I'll be on the lookout for those as well. A lot of you have said that you want me to start showing some different stuff so I'm gonna see what else we can find. I probably won't show any Ray Dunn just gonna try to show some different stuff. I definitely have my own patterns and routines that I fall into at Home Goods. So we're gonna try to break the routine today and I'm gonna try to show you some different stuff in this video. So I hope you like good old fashioned Home Goods shop with me because that's what we are up to today. So let's head inside to Home Goods and let's get shopping. This outdoor set is absolutely stunning. Love all of like the woven details. I love the color of the wood and the table and how it all matches. Don't love the price, but it's definitely worth it. This is extremely nice outdoor furniture. Okay, I also love this mirror. What's interesting about it is that it's like Home Goods brand, which I have never seen before. That it's like actually like labeled as Home Goods. Really, really pretty. It is gold, but it's like a rubbed gold, so it has, you know, it's not completely perfect. It's a little bit more like rusky vintage. It is $249. It's so huge. It's massive. I'm obsessed with this. I'm over in like the lamps, so the lighting should be pretty good. But I am testing out a new mask today. This is the Old Navy Kids Active Mask. It fits amazing. I'm obsessed with it. Normally I have to like fold the bottom of my mask under because it just like comes down to like here. I never really saw how small my face was until like COVID when everybody started wearing masks and I couldn't find any that fit me. I do really like the disposable ones, but I'm really loving these so far, but I'm gonna test it. My issue typically is I can't take anything pulling at the back of my ears because I get really bad migraines. So if I wear like sunglasses for too long or a baseball hat or anything pulls on my ears, I will get an instant like headache or a headache that lasts like five days. So I'm trying to avoid that. So I'll definitely let you know what I think about this because I just put it on. So first impressions, I really like it. It fits awesome. And I'll keep you updated on like the ear pulling comfort situation. But so far I really like it. It doesn't like go into my mouth when I talk and it's not slipping down at all. I always see your guys' comments that are like, your masks don't fit right. I'm trying, it's just so hard for me to find a mask that fits and doesn't slip down when I talk. But so far this one's really passing the test. I never really look at the lamps. Lighting is not something I think about that much. I definitely should, but it's one of those things that, like I can't really buy till we move into our new apartment. This is really cool though. I like the different like Edison bulbs wrapped into this like wooden box and it does have a little black handle on the top. Definitely like an alternative different style of lamp, but I really like it. This is really pretty. It almost looks like a jar, like a, an olive oil jar, if that like, you see what I'm saying? It kind of reminds me of that. I like how it's like hollow on the inside and you can see it and then it's glass with the black accents. I feel like the shade doesn't really go with it, but you can always change it. It's really easy to change out a little like lamp shade to make a lamp look a different style. But I really do like this one and it is $40. These are super nice. These Ralph Lauren ones, they are $60. They're just so sleek. I love how it's clear again with the gold. I don't love the lamp shade on this one. This one is Tommy Hilfiger and it looks almost identical. This one's $10 cheaper. And I like the shade on that one a lot more. It doesn't like, go in at an angle at all. It's like totally just round and it's more of like a white, whereas this one is a cream. Kind of crazy, honestly, those look almost identical, but I like this one better and it's cheaper. These are pretty, pretty, pretty. I love the white linen lampshade. 
and I really like the shape of it. These are $30, they do have two of them, and they have gold accents, but they're like a champagne colored gold, not like a super, super bright gold, which I really love. They are a good size too, perfect for a nightstand. These are really pretty too. I like how they are woven. I do have two of them, and it's not gold at the bottom, it's just like a tan color that matches with these really pretty white lampshades, and then the metal is gold. I love the look of those. They are really pretty. And what I love too about home goods here with like the lamps and stuff is that they have a bunch of plugs so you can plug all the lamps in and they all come with a light bulb so you can see what it's gonna look like in your house. Okay, so typically when I shop at home goods, I shop the whole perimeter and then the inside, which is why I tend not to show a lot of the inside because by the time I get to like the middle decor aisles, I've already showed so much stuff. So this time we're gonna shop the inside out which my brain like is having a hard time processing, but we're gonna try it different today. That way I can show you a different variety of stuff than I normally do. All times of the year, but especially right now during the spring, they have a great variety of potted plants. I really love this one. I love like the super simple white pot and it's a really good size. It is only $14.99, which is a really good deal, but it does look like extremely fake because these are super shiny. But I really like the size of it and I really like the like clean white pot that it's in. So many of my favorite colors, green, yellow, white, blue, actually all my favorite colors. And also, who doesn't need a marble head as a planter? or a Buddha as a planter. They have some really funny stuff right now. This planter is really cool. It is, I can't tell if it's plaster, but it has just this little like arrow detail and it's actually painted to look like wood and it does have legs. It's a really good size and I love the style of it and the look of it too. You can make it match with like any type of decor, any other like bonus color you wanted to add. This one looks just like the ones I showed in one of my Walmart videos like a couple weeks back or maybe a couple months back at this point. It had that like woven look to it but it was ceramic just like this one. And this one comes on legs but this looks just like the one from Walmart. This is a great price too. This is only $25. It's definitely a better deal to get these types of like planters here than it is to get them at Target. Right on this end cap because I'm by like the front like outdoor area they have a lot of like stuff Easter bunnies. I really like this one that is sitting in the rocking chair. It's just super detailed. It is $80 and I wonder if there's like another one that matches it. Here is like the same one but I really like how detailed it is. I don't really know like where you could put that in your house like maybe by your front door on the inside because it's kind of short but it would be too tall to put it on a countertop. If you have any ideas, let me know. I really love these little bunnies, these blue and white bunnies. They are, oh, Polish pottery. That's really cool. I don't think I've ever found anything from Poland, but they have these two that go together, and then they do have these little eggs. Perfect little candy dishes. You know me and my candy dishes. And they have a lot of little garlands. This one is awesome. It's little burlap bunnies, and then little orange burlap carrots. Then they have this six-foot garland, which is just a bunch of different patterns of carrots. They're all super orange. Very, very Easter, but I like the pattern mixing a lot. Okay, I actually am obsessed with these three little carrots. The blue flowers are really pretty. It would be perfect to go right into spring. For the three carrots, it is $5.99, and I love these. I have not seen anything like this yet. Okay, I think we found more of that like Polish little glass. These are more Americana to me. Are we already getting Fourth of July stuff? I'm not ready for that yet. And I say that because they have this too. They have this little egg, which is extremely Americana to me at least. That's just what it reminds me of. The inside is hollow, so you could put whatever you want in there, but I'm not ready for the 4th of July yet. This candy jar is awesome. It's huge, or not candy jar actually, I would say like a cookie jar. It's just a big egg, and then the knob is a little bunny on top. I really like that. Why do they have to put the price on the bottom? Let's go underneath. This is $12.99. I feel like that's a really good deal. Haven't seen anything else like this. I wonder if it comes in different colors. They have these like life-size bunnies and they're like, I think grandma and grandpa bunnies. They are $99 a piece, but they're very detailed. They have these like brooches. The buttons are super detailed all the way down to like the hat, his umbrella. And then she has like a purse that has a little brooch on it. She has eyelashes and this really intricate hat. These are so fun if we had a house these would be coming home with me over in the outdoor section they do have a lot of like branded stuff i know my grandparents they collected all coca-cola merch of course it was a lot more vintage back then because they were born in the 30s but they still do sell a lot of that old like vintage looking coca-cola stuff 
Then they also have more like outdoor beachy stuff. Like they have Corona, Budweiser. But this is what caught my attention, this Bluetooth cooler speaker. It's such a good idea. It's so fun to like be able to play your own music when you're at the beach. And this is cool because it would just play right out of your cooler so you could knock two birds with one stone and your cooler would also be your Bluetooth speaker. Just found these chargers right behind me. These are so pretty. You get four woven chargers for $20, which is such a good deal. They have a couple packs of them here, but these are honestly super nice. I really like this little basket that's under it too. But you can use things like this for a basketball. Like just you be creative. No one's gonna know. It's literally that TikTok that's like, nobody's gonna know. How would they know? That's what I'm saying. They have them in square as well. So square chargers, I've never seen that, but that's definitely pretty unique. I've never seen a square charger before. I found the square ones in white as well. Like a white washed. Those are super unique. If you have square chargers or if you've seen them, I'm definitely gonna have to look that up on Pinterest because I wanna see how they look actually on someone's table. Here's an example of something that I could add to my basket wall. It does come off the wall, but honestly, it's so nice to add the 3D elements and this is only $12.99. Okay, I know some of you guys are gonna think this is weird, but I actually really like shopping the food <laughs> at Home Goods. They have some really good deals on like cool sauces, soup mixes, olive oils that are super nice, spice mixes. Just check the date, but most of the time you'll be good to go. And they have some really cool stuff that you're not gonna find at the grocery store because they're more like specialty items. Let's shop some stuff and see what we find. These little soup mixes caught my eye. I love to shop these from World Market. They just tell you what you have to add, but it's a really easy meal. They have chicken and thyme soup for $2.99. It's just like all the spices and the little pastas. And then it just tells you everything else you need to add. They're super easy. These are the two catching my eye, but I think I'm gonna pick up this one. I don't know, white chicken chili seems like it would be a little bit too heavy for Florida. Now that we're basically in summer, it's super hot here already. So I'm gonna pick up this one just to have when we're like in a pinch and we want something really cozy. But they do have lots of other brands of stuff like that. This one is tomato basil soup mix. Oh, that's kind of cool. Quinoa and kale soup mix, creamy cauliflower soup mix, and it just tells you everything you have to add. Like I was saying, they have tons of different olive oils. Honestly, some of them are like straight from Italy and they're super legit. A lot of them come in really cool bottles and it's a fraction of the price of what you'd pay for like Barilla olive oil at the grocery store. I'd say definitely check it out. Honestly, I don't think olive oil like ever truly goes bad So this is definitely a good place to shop for stuff like that. These are really cool. These like different pestos This one is mushroom truffle pesto. They also have this like basil pesto black olive spread another basil pesto so many different things like this. I feel like way more options than the grocery store. Just check it out. Fun spice mixes too. They have this one, this roasted garlic, rosemary, and sea salt, paprika, lemon, and lime, roast vegetables, and fries. Salad spectacular spice blend. So I guess maybe you just like shake it over a salad, oregano, basil, and tomato, spicy stir fry. Ooh, that one sounds yummy. The prices are great and there's a ton in here. I don't know, these are all just so awesome. I don't know, I just love shopping this stuff here. Okay, the last thing I will say about the food is it's a really good place to find like unique flavors of jams and jellies for charcuterie boards. They have a lot of little like small batch brands. We have tried this one, the hot pepper bacon jam, but they have a lot of different flavors like boysenberry, apricot pepper jelly, three fruit marmalade, like so many different ones. And these are perfect for like cheese board, charcuterie board. You guys are gonna have to trust me with this one and just look for yourself. And if you find anything cool, definitely report back. Over in the home decor now, it's a great place to shop for candles, like these absolutely massive candles. This one is $14.99, pink grapefruit Prosecco. Let's give her a whiff. It smells amazing. <laughs> I wish it was $10. I try to find the biggest ones I can that are only $10. They also have these ones, which are like a million wick candles. This one is eucalyptus and lavender. It smells super fresh. It has a lot of wicks, so I do think it would burn like through really fast if you like to light your candles for a long time. But this could be just like more decorative if you want, and it is $19.99. Home Goods has so much pretty decor for like all different styles. I don't know if it's just because I'm in Florida, but we have a huge aisle and selection of like coastal beachy stuff. This is really pretty. I like how it's like on the glass base, these different like types of coral or like imitation coral. 
they do have this blue one and then this pink one which is really pretty and caught my eye this one is $20 and it's like modern beachy so I really like these this would be perfect too like on a coffee table you could put like your remotes in it or some vase filler it just looks like coral as well and that is $30. They're definitely like mixing up different styles. Like this is really, really pretty. It's almost like boho coastal. This is $20. It's gold and then it's on this like marble slab. It's really pretty. Would definitely look great on like an entryway table. But if you just like take the time to look at all the different aisles, like even if you think that it's not going to have stuff that's your style, like I absolutely love this vase and I wouldn't have found it if I didn't come down here. It is $14.99. It's just super neutral, but I like how there's different like patterns on it. This candle literally smells like heaven. The only, I mean, it is vanilla pineapple. It's very vanilla-y. The pineapple is super, like, not faint, but just, like, soft, I guess. This smells so good. This one is $14.99 as well. I love this, like, three-tiered rattan or rattan tray. It looks like it's damaged or it, it, a different one is damaged. But this one is broken as well. You could definitely glue it with wood glue. So you could probably get this for a discount because if it's broken, they can't sell it at full price. This could be like an alternative to a bar cart because it has the three different levels and you can put all your different like bar stuff in it. And there's definitely enough room between each one to fit bottles. I really like this. Full price, it is $50, but I'm guessing that they would take at least 20% off. I feel like this blue and white like pottery is like really making a comeback. This is really pretty, caught my eye. Made in Portugal, it's such like a royal blue color. But all of these are just so pretty, these like little blue and white pots. Definitely coastal as well. It's just like its own style. I don't really know exactly like what kind of style these are or what they go. I just think like Charleston, probably because I know some of the people who watch my videos that I talk to on Instagram a lot are from Charleston and they love this stuff. So I'm just gonna call it Charleston decor. This is the prettiest tray. It's woven and it has this really pretty cane detail. Why am I singing? Anyways, this is super pretty. It is $40. It's huge. If you have the most massive coffee table ever, this could be great or a really big kitchen island and then just put all your stuff in here. Great layering detail. You know I'm all about layering. Is this a wooden octopus for $20? Do I wish it had a face? Yes, it's Tommy Bahama. And then they have some like crystals over here too. $24.99. They also have this one. I know this one is amethyst. That one's probably like a white quartz or something. I don't know. I'm not like a crystal expert. I just am surrounded by people who love crystals, which is really awesome. These are really pretty too. Like look at that. This looks exactly like the new Levi's collection from Target. This looks like exactly what it was dipped in. Don't you think? If you saw that video, let me know if you agree. More amethyst. This is like a little candle holder. That's kind of cool, but I'm afraid the wax would ruin it. Like if you actually used it, but you could definitely scrape it out. Okay, I just found what I think to, would be like the coolest coffee table book ever. And it is The Secret Language of Birthdays. So your complete personality guide for each day of the year. Obviously, of course, I went straight to my birthday, but in the beginning of the book, they have like a really in-depth like look at like birth charts and like the different seasons and all about the different astrological signs and like if you're on the cusp, that sort of thing. But of course, I did go and read my birthday, which if you didn't know is September 3rd. It's just so cool. It gives you like an in-depth overview of like what people would be like who are born on that day, other famous people or inventors who were born on that day, your numerology, your tarot, health and advice, meditation, your strengths and weaknesses. I am obsessed with this. I feel like if you saw this on someone's coffee table, of course you'd want to go and read all about your birthday. I'm just so in love with this book. I sent Brian his too, but I think I'm going to have to buy it because I'm just so in love with stuff like this. And it's such a huge book. I wish that it wasn't like red on underneath because I want to use it as a coffee table book, but I'm going to find a way to make it work because I just think this is the coolest book ever. Just found this really pretty big vase. You could honestly just have it as its own decor by like an entryway table or in the corner of a room with some pompous grass would be really, really nice. I just had to lift it up to find the price and it is $50. 
honestly like makes a pretty nice statement on its own but if you added some really tall pompous grass it would be stunning i never show this because honestly i never come in this aisle but they have a lot of really awesome like tissue paper cards gift bags they have really really awesome prices on this as well you get 120 sheets for 3.99 literally i just bought 25 sheets for 3.99 yesterday at target they do have a lot of different colors they have like metallics they have prints this one has like little bees and stuff perfect for like a baby shower but they have a lot of really good options and they also do have some wrapping paper all year round during christmas they have like hundreds and hundreds of rolls of wrapping paper but this is something that they do have here i just don't really show it ever because honestly i always forget that they have it they do have other like stationery other more like thicker gift boxes or like keepsake boxes and then other little like paper plates and plastic plates but more like decorative really nice ones over here as well really cute thank you cards this is 5.99 and you get this whole box and it does come with the envelopes and everything too you get 50 cards and 50 envelopes and they always have like all different little designs to choose from but these are the ones that they have right now this set even comes with like little stickers to put on the back of the envelope to seal it so they have a lot of different options definitely make sure you check them out look how cute the envelopes are in this one they always have so many fun different options and they do also carry more like plain ones if you don't want ones that are like super decorative they have that too these chairs are stunning and they're such a good price they're like rope woven and then just like a nice natural wood color such a good price 129 dollars. i have seen four of them because now i see two here and i saw two in another part of the store they are just super nice honestly of course i always find all this stuff after i already buy other stuff i always say this is the best place to get hangers they have the really nice velvet hangers you can get 25 for like 10 to 15 dollars honestly they're all the same but just look for the ones that are the cheapest where you get the most they have all different colors i even have a bunch more over there i redid my whole closet i love velvet hangers brian personally does not like them he wants to stick with the plastic ones but these take up so much less space and your clothes don't slip off of them i definitely recommend recommend getting them especially here because they're a really good price literally this whole aisle is full of them i don't even think i've ever seen this many at once and they do have name brands too like this one is brookstone so these ones are 14.99 but then these ones that are like ellen degeneres are only 10 dollars. but honestly i feel like they're the same so just pick whichever ones you like this is a really pretty little like entertainment center it's 500 of course there's like a piece of styrofoam it just has like two little drawers but i just like the detailing of it it's like textured and then it was a little bit like weathered looking but i feel like you could easily change out the hardware from like a dark silver chromey to like a gold or whatever and it would work for a lot of different styles this is a really pretty like chest i wish that it had one more it was like three. Ooh, it was definitely a little bit tough to get open it's really pretty it is 199 perfect for like some clothes or if you need like a small entertainment center and you have like a smaller tv this would be perfect for underneath it could also work as a little like buffet so you can like hide stuff on the inside and then some like wine bottles or decorative drinkware on the top i'm obsessed with this office wear line i really can't remember if i've showed it in a video before so i'm sorry if i have i'll make this really brief i just love the gold mixed with the natural obviously here is another one of those pots that i actually showed in the beginning but this one doesn't have legs and you could actually use any of these pots too as like a waste basket bag no bag like the clear little trash bags would work perfect but look at all of this really pretty stuff they have a bunch of different things that go with the line i do think i've showed this before so i'm not going to talk anymore about it but if i haven't yet really pretty office stuff right now okay hidden over in the little office section they have these incredibly gorgeous macrame decorations this is like a waning crescent and a waxing crescent with a full moon then they have one that's like the tree of life i feel like brian would really like this one because he actually has the tree of life tattooed on him then they have these massive dream catchers couple different styles i don't know why they have this stuff hiding over here it's beautiful these are really unique i have not seen anything like this here before but they are circle canvases and they're like painted on there i feel like you never see any different shapes besides for like square or rectangle so these are really cool to see i the more i touch them i feel like they're about to fall and obviously i don't want to drop them all but these are 60 dollars. these are really cool and unique and they're also massive so it would take up a really good portion of wall if you have a lot of wall space you need to get filled in i really like these super different definitely check your home goods for these i don't know why but they have these little nightstands hidden in the dog section but i really like them they're 80 dollars a piece they're kind of like a warm cool tone so they're not 
gray, but they're not beige. They're kind of like in between. They do have chrome hardware, but you could definitely switch that out and make this more like gold toned or warm toned. It just has one little drawer. These are some perfect little nightstands. These are really nice over by the kids section. They're like little bookshelves. They have a gray one and a white one. They're 99. Three rows for bookshelves, and then you could do like toys on the bottom. These are actually super nice. I feel like my sister would love this. My nephew, he's like obsessed with learning and reading. He's the smartest kid ever. Literally, he's four, and the last time we FaceTimed, which was like two days ago, he asked me what was the capital of Moldova. But he knows. He knows the capital to every single country, to every single state, and knows where they all are. It's, it's mind-blowing. He like needs to go on Ellen. I always die when I see these, these little kid like recliners. They have a leather one too, but these ones have cup holders. These are amazing. We had these as kids, but I don't think that they were this fancy if I'm honest. I do think that they were recliners, but I don't think they looked exactly like the adult versions. These are so cute. I definitely think that we'll have these for our kids someday when we have kids, cause look how funny they are. As I'm sure you guys have noticed, I don't really show a lot of kids stuff. They have a ton of it here, of course, but I just feel like it's not, because I don't have kids, uh, it's not really like my forte and maybe you guys watch other people for that. But if you want me to start showing some of the kids stuff that they have at like my home goods and TJ Maxx's and stuff, or even Target, um, definitely let me know because I would love to. I like love looking at kids stuff, baby stuff and talking about that because I can't wait to have kids. So if that's something you want to see from me, definitely just let me know and I will show you. And just like that, we're back up at the front of the store with the rugs and the furniture where I normally start. It was super fun going around the other way, kind of like starting in the middle and working my way out. It's just fun because like I said, normally like I get so tied up showing you guys everything in the perimeter that I forget to show you the middle. So hopefully this gave you guys a good idea of some of the other types of decor that they have in the store right now. I've literally been searching for any of the Ray Dunn St. Patrick's Day stuff everywhere. And I finally found this canister, but I found it because it is broken. Brian is obsessed with St. Patrick's Day and I really wanted to surprise him with one of these, but I don't know if it's worth it to buy it when it's already broken. Okay, I just got done at HomeGoods, but I just wanted to let you know that I'm a big fan of the mask. I really, really like these masks. These are, again, the kids' Old Navy Active ones. I will link them for you down below. If you have a small head or a small face, I definitely recommend them. They do have adjustable ears. I will say my ears are, like, getting a little bit sore, so I feel like I would still carry, like, disposable masks if I have to wear it for longer, like, if I'm going to Disney or if I'm, like, filming multiple videos just because... The cute masks are just not worth getting a headache, honestly. But I really, really like this mask and I just wanted to let you know that I give it a big thumbs up. Alrighty, you guys, well, that is gonna be it for me today. I hope that you loved seeing all of the fun stuff that I found at Home Goods. Honestly, people are always like, don't you get sick of going to Home Goods? I never do because, like I showed you today, you can always find different stuff every single time you go is a totally different adventure. I always say that in these videos, but it is so true. If you loved this video and you haven't yet, definitely make sure you give it a big thumbs up. Hit the subscribe button down below and I will see you next time. Bye, guys.